This squadron is gonna be a lot different from any other gunship squadron that we've had. We were going to be the test bed of, hey, this is how the gunship squadron operates. We're getting a lot smaller, so the level of expertise willing to work, and then more importantly, the level of the expectation to innovate and find new ways to do things is going to be massive. This plane is a lot more pilot friendly. Um, what that means is not necessarily that it's easier to fly or anything like that, but the plane requires me as a pilot to know a lot less about the individual systems. That being said, because I don't have the corporate knowledge, uh, I basically have to rely on our maintenance personnel a lot more uh, to help us diagnose, fix, and then just get the airplane airborne. And then eventually myself, the rest of the TAC crew will show up and then we'll flow into our jobs. And so the thing, good thing about it and the reason that I wanted to come to C-130s out of pilot training um, was because I didn't want to fly a single seat aircraft. I wanted to fly an aircraft that had a crew on it because I like to rely on other people to help me do my job because that force structure will make my life a lot easier and make me better at what I do. You don't always have to succeed, but we have guys that are willing to step out of the box, willing to come up with new ideas, figure out how we're going to do this with less people. And because of that, we're expecting a lot out of everybody that comes uh, to work for us, but we're only getting top-notch people. We're smaller, and we're going to stay smaller, and so because of that, guys at younger levels, uh, you know, younger enlisted guys are going to have a lot more face time with higher, higher-ranking individuals, and they're killing it. They're doing, a, they're doing a great job. It's important to see, you know, we talk about the level to corner, like all the stuff we have, all the heritage that is up, and so as we continue to move forward, you change with the times, but you just continue to build upon that heritage, not rest upon the laurels that they created back in the day. It's just creating new heritage that'll happen here in the future.